Zach, I didn't know if you'd heard about... Uh, what are you doing? Zach, what? Why do you do this to yourself? You're living here with all these memories around you, and it's like you're living in the past. It's almost like you're waiting for Michael to come back. He did. Michael was here the other day, along with you. What do you mean? Like he was... He was here like a ghost? No. His spirit. The heart and the soul of the brother I loved. Not the rapist that everyone wanted to end up on the landfill. Well, it's, I mean, it's good that you have good memories of him. Yeah, is it? My brother begged me not to give up on him. What do I do with that? Do I, I just ignore my instincts? Who do I trust to tell me the truth? You can trust the woman who loved you. I wish you could see Michael through my eyes. But you hadn't seen him in so many years. People change. Change how? From trusting and loyal to a, to a rapist liar? Well, the worst mistake he ever made was coming to this town. Well, a lot of people in town would agree with you. <sighs> they made him a scapegoat, and he paid the ultimate price, I think. For what? For the cumulative sins of Pine Valley? Yeah, maybe so. And what do you think, they don't exist? Greed, envy, pride, jealousy, they're all here. I can count the people that I've trusted in my life on one hand. And Michael was one of them. I wish I could help you. Well, you can't help me. Just got to wrestle with this on my own, okay? Why are you here? Well, I came to tell you that Ethan was arrested. When? For, for what charge? Tonight, for attempted murder of Ryan Lavery. 